Alrighty! Little video here just to say fuck Survivor Series 2019. Um, I'm probably gonna order it because I have a feeling it's gonna be pretty bad. I gotta review it, blah blah blah. Why? Because I'm a fucking retard, that's why. But if you don't have a podcast, if you don't make vids with this shit, I strongly suggest that you do not order this pay-per-view. Not one match is interesting on this card. Kofi Kingston versus The Miz. You know, these guys have nothing to do with each other. Miz refuses to tag in like a week ago. Not even on Monday, two, three, four days ago. And this is a match for the pay-per-view. Just like this. That match, worthless. A 14 Diva elimination match. I think it's elimination. Um, just a big pile of shit is what that is. Every Diva is probably going to wrestle like 10 seconds or something. The match is going to last like 4 minutes for 14 wrestlers. Cody Rhodes, Goldust, The Usos, and Mysterio against The Shield and The Real Americans. I still cannot figure out why they put Shield and Real Americans together. Total garbage, worthless. Probably guaranteed Rey Mysterio is going to, you know, win. He's going to be the big star of the match. Then he's going to be injured and he'll be gone in two days or something. Um, yeah. What they should have done is the shield against the Wyatts three on three elimination. When they stood face to face on Raw, people were into it. Okay, but then they fucked this up there. So by the time they finally have a match... Nobody's going to care. They should have done Wyatt's against the Shield at Survivor Series. Punk and Brian against the Wyatt's. People like Punk. People like Brian. People like the Wyatt's. But this is just a simple tag team match. Doesn't make a shit difference who wins or loses. Just a throwaway tag match that could have happened on Superstars or SmackDown. This doesn't deserve to be seen as a big giant match, okay? Cena against Del Rio. We've seen this about a thousand times. Cena's gonna win, it's obvious. He's not gonna lose right away. If he would have lost right away, they would have gave the belt to Sandow. I still feel sick to my stomach that Sandow didn't win. And Orton versus The Big Show. Another match that we've seen a billion times. And Orton usually wins all of the matches, okay? Um, a big, boring motherfucker trying to be Stone Cold Steve Austin for some reason. Against Orton, a boring son of a bitch. Straight up, maybe the weirdest, most boring wrestler on the roster right now, well, not as boring as Curtis Axel there, but he's pretty fucking boring. Not one match is great. Orton and Big Show, a joke for a main event. A pathetic joke for what used to be a great pay-per-view Survivor Series. You had Hogan, Austin, all the good wrestlers at Survivor Series. Now it's a worthless, pathetic joke. Big Show against Orton, really? They could have done way, way, way better than this. Do not fucking order this shit. Do not. Alrighty, until next time. Peace.